Hello everyone, a very warm welcome to my weekly update. It is full on AGM season, so I am clocking up the miles this week. And I'm actually at Barn and Broom in Norfolk for the Norfolk AGM. I did the Hertfordshire AGM this morning and I was in Essex last night for their AGM. It is brilliant to see so many members uh, at these meetings. I know for us, the office holder team, it's just fantastic to be out and engaging so much going on and many of you will probably be aware at the beginning of the week uh, I met with my sixth Secretary of State in six years so Steve Barclay recently appointed as DEFRA Secretary of State. I did actually quite a lot with Steve when he was at uh, the Cabinet Office and he was actually then Boris Johnson's Chief of Staff um, so he still had my telephone number in, in his uh, in his phone and he gave me a call when he'd been put into office and I was actually the first one to have a meeting with him on his first day so I had an hour with him and effectively that the, the meeting was in three buckets on my part really wanting to talk about the situation in sugar for government to use its powers in the Food Act for British Sugar uh, and the NFU Sugar team to sit down at the table and, and sort this mess out, quite honestly. So that was one part of the discussion. The other was on bovine TB. Really important that government walks the talk on all of this and we have that comprehensive 25 year uh, eradication plan that is fully in place with epi leg culling as part of that. And then also going on to talk about the SFI, the challenges with the rollout and replacement of BPS uh, and then finally, I guess, you know, the Prime Minister's commitment to food security, setting the new target, the annual reporting, the real need to get that over the line, to level up, as I was pointing out to him, with the environmental commitment, with the food production commitment, all things that I've said to you before. But, you know, he's been a, a big hitter, effectively, Steve Barclay. He was at the top of the May government, leading, uh, exiting from the European Union, DEXU, if you remember it was called at the time. He's been Chief Secretary, he was Chief of Staff to the Prime Minister, he was in the Cabinet Office and obviously recently at Health. And I refer to it as being promoted now to the most important department in government leading DEFRA. So critical times. But anyway, I need to get in to the AGM in Norfolk. I'm already running late. So wherever you are, as ever, please do take care. And I look forward to speaking to you again next week. Many thanks.